What's up guys? It has been a little over a year since we first got our Gators glasses. So if you want to see how they're holding up, stay tuned. So yeah, when we got in contact with the Gators guys in person for the first time, they were really excited to meet the team and to dive into our social media and find all the, co the cool content that, that we, put, we post. Just like that, this sponsorship with Gators was born and the Gators glasses that we were given were not spared any abuse ever since. Don't let the little intro of this video fool you. Most of us have used these every day as a regular set of sunglasses doubling duties as protective eyewear in the field and also in the in the shooting range. So guys, when you look at these glasses, the first thing that stands out is precisely the fact that they don't stand out. What I mean by this is that they don't scream tactical like many other glasses out there. Yeah, this is indeed a very desirable feature for some, as one is not limited to the occasion or event uh, or even the attire in which you can use them. Uh, however, for the trained eye, uh, it is not so much the case. Their staked logo on the temple area of the glasses, although discreet, has become uh, the trademark of the product and it doesn't go unnoticed. While already used on the battlefield by US Special Forces throughout the world, uh, these glasses have really been made popular thanks to the big screen movies and TV shows like Lone Survivor, Benghazi, the, the SEAL Team show. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, just a few examples of uh, a lot of shows out there that yeah, I mean, like, make a lot of uh, commercials about these glasses. Yeah. So guys, I would say the feature that separates these glasses the most from others is the material that they're made of. Gators are made from billet 7075 aluminum, which, just out of curiosity, is the same material that AR-15 receivers are made of. Making them very lightweight, yeah. resistant. Very resistant. Um, the shape that they have, they, they wrap around your face, not obstructing your, your field of view. Uh, and they are, they're also very thin on the temples, which make them very comfortable to use with ear pro, without giving you those shitty headaches that everyone has experienced. Uh, also, just be aware, everything comes with a con, so being made of metal, they also heat up a lot. You don't notice it when you're wearing it, but if you leave it under the sun for a while, when you try to put them on, yeah, they will burn your skin. Yeah, you'll burn your sure. body. You will burn your face. Did I say this was a love story? No. It's a horror movie. So one more thing that makes them really uh, custom tailored for the user is that they can be adjusted uh, to, you, to the user's face by bending the frame. Uh, it's really simple, you, you grab on, you grab on the, the sides and you bend it and you can really conform it to your face. One thing I do recommend is to check Gator's video, they have a YouTube channel and they post a video out there on how to adjust it, uh, just to avoid damaging the glasses and have a little concern there. So, now speaking of the lenses, they're made of a really impact resistant ballistic, uh, great polycarbonate, more than enough for any kind of sport or even airsoft, which is what regards us the most. Yeah. So, uh, if you're looking for the ultimate protection, they also have the Z versions, which take all this up on a notch. Yeah, which, which these are. These are the, the Z version. We'll, we'll put a close up uh, for you guys to see. Uh, the lenses are not only crystal clear, but they're, they're more resistant than, than any other, I would say glasses that I've at least ever tried. Yeah, even they're 100% UV protect, uh, UV proof, uh, scratch resistant and water dirt repellent, so. Yeah, now with all good products, uh, they can go without their drawbacks. And there are certainly some cons that we would like to point out from the day one uh, that we told Gators that despite their sponsorship, any review that we made of this product would be totally honest be it good or bad, so here it goes. 
The first one is the lack of a lens exchange feature. I mean, this is what really gives glasses their strength and rigidity uh, for you, the end user. If you want to, to have both dark and, and clear lenses, buying both glasses is your only option. Unless you want to go with their photochromic lenses, uh, which we, we do have a pair in the team, and they basically turn clear when it's dark out and they turn dark when it's bright. Uh, just keep in mind, they'll never be as clear or as dark as standard lenses. Then we have the anti fog coating, which is uh, mind-blowing to say the least, but it's only present in certain models. So uh, we would like to see Gators making this standard in all their models and uh, we believe this is a very important feature. Uh, in the meantime, like, if you are thinking of buying a pair of Gators, uh, we highly recommend this upgrade. Yeah, also, uh, don't quote me on this because I'm not 100% sure, uh, but I do believe that all Z models, the, the extended uh, protection models, they do come with this coating. Uh, mine certainly do because I've tried everything to make them fog and I, I just can't do it. I just can't do it. So, I mean, if, if you're on the fence about the regular model or the Z model, uh, you, I mean, I guess the Z yeah. model is a, is a nice upgrade. Right. You pay a little extra, but you get both the edge protection uh, and the the fog protection as well. So, guys, last but not least, the price is high. Yeah, yeah it is high. We're not gonna lie. Base models start at 180 euros mark and go up to 235. Yeah, but then the top ones. then again, keep in mind that it's in line with with similar models from other manufacturers, right? If you go with a premium uh, premium mo model of, of protective eyewear, you're going to pay premium price. Sure, There's no question sure. about it. We're not talking about uh, low budget, low quality. I mean, sometimes th there is some quality there, but I'm, we're talking about premium product, right? Yeah. So they are expensive, but are they are worth, they it? worth it? Yeah, that, that's the For question. Sure. Yeah, I think they are. Like, I've, I've used this exact model that I'm using right now extensively, and they look and feel just like the day I got them. So the lenses are super clear, and they have never, ever scratched, not once fogged up on me, and there isn't a single scratch on them. So, so yeah, we're super happy with ours, and we'll keep recommending them for what they are. One of the best iPro in the market worldwide. Uh, now, sure, sure. Uh, our premise with Gators was that we were going to receive their glasses, test them for a whole year, which we did extensively, uh, and then make a review. Now, from now on, if they're gonna keep sponsoring us, we don't know. Uh, am I gonna buy uh, the next model that they're put out, even if they're not sponsoring me? Probably. Most likely, yeah. yeah. I really like the, the, their new Delta model. It's a little, even a little more discreet than these. They look like regular shades that you would wear to the beach, but still have the same Quality, polarized lenses polarized if you lenses. if you're into that the same ballistic same protection everything yeah everything so, so the quality is exactly the same just another model yeah don't, don't think that it's because we have been sponsored for this year uh, by gators that we're making this biased review i would still buy their product uh if they if it wasn't given given to me so yeah, yeah guys that's it uh yeah. thanks for watching this video and uh, make sure you check our channel social media and everything and stay tuned for the next one. yeah we also have a website uh, we have all the details about gators i wear what they're made of their materials everything uh so go check it out until next time take care like and subscribe see you next time